million rupees they spent. Imagine they flew over the crew. They're only for one program, three hours, three days, and he goes back. If you know the budgets of these Christian missionary organizations, on average, it is more than a million dollars a day. Jimmy Swaggart, who debated with Sheikh Ahmed Didad, he required more than $400 million annually to keep his head above water. More than $1 million a day is their budget. We are nothing. I don't know for any Islamic Dawah organization in the world which even has 10% of that budget. Any Dawah organization, I have traveled different parts of the world. But the professionalism that they have, these Christian missionaries, they are trained. They are trained in giving talks. We hardly know of any Islamic Dawah organization who trains people in public speaking. Today, scientific research tells us that if a person gives a talk on the stage in public, the matter he speaks carries only 7% weightage. Only 7%. 93% is presentation skills. How does he modulate his voice, his eye-to-eye contact, his gestures? The reason I don't have a podium is why? Not that I have a very good physique. is because I want to have my body language. Even my body is speaking. We in Islamic Research Foundation Bombay, we train professionally Muslims how to convey the message of Islam. We train not only Indians, we even train foreigners. We have got Americans who have come to organization. We have got Britishers, people from Singapore, from UAE, from Malaysia, from Saudi Arabia. Scholars who have passed from Madhya University. We train them, we specialize in the field of how to convey the message of Islam. How many Muslim organizations we have? Imagine, how can I die? How can I go in the battlefield without my weapon? If the microphone system is not good, how can I fight? This is my weapon. But when Muslim organizations call me throughout the world, they keep me in a five-star hotel. But the sound system is useless. When I accept an invitation, I tell them, the sound system should be good. I will sleep on the floor, no problem. I don't require a five-star hotel. I'm a die. I can sleep on the floor. But give me a good sound system, it doesn't cost much. But give a professional good sound system. To hire doesn't cost much, it is much less. A small percentage of paying the bill for a five-star hotel. They'll keep me in a five-star hotel, but they don't realize the importance of the sound system. What we Muslims should do, we should train ourselves in the media. To specialize in the field of public speaking is a speciality. Print media is a different speciality. Audio media is a different speciality. Video media is a different speciality. We have to be specialized. And today, we have radio broadcast stations. How many Muslims are doing their job? How many? We have the computer, we have the internet. When the internet started, there was more information against Islam than for Islam on the internet. Now, Alhamdulillah, there are some Muslims who have also got into the field. But the Christians are ahead of us. The moment we give a reply, they give the counter reply. On the internet. And the sites are such, I don't want to name them, I don't want to make them popular. The sites are such, you will think it is an Islamic site. You'll go to it. It is a snake in your sleeves. The magazine that they print, they have organizations in India, Darul Nijat, Home of Salvation. Arabic name. Who is the president? Sultan. Sultan who? Sultan Paul. <laughs> Nidai Umid. Call for hope. It's a Christian organization. So please don't go on names. Same on the internet you go. I don't want to give the names of this site. Otherwise everyone will go. And many will get misguided. They give such information which a normal Muslim, even he will not be able to reply. They pick up verses of the Quran and they attack. So as I told you, the media, the media is good as well as bad. It is positive as well as negative. Like a knife, it can be used for good purpose and for wrong purpose. If you cut vegetables and bread, it is good. If you use for robbing, it is bad. Similarly, the media has got advantages and disadvantages. It has got positive points, it has got negative points. It has good things, it has got bad things. What we should do, we should utilize the science and technology and turn the tables over and utilize it for good work.
today majority of the media is used for work which is not good that's the reason most of the ulama most of the shiuks they say that the media stay away from it and i'm for them i'm not against them i'm for them because most of the thing that comes in your house the satellite channel it makes you go away from islam rather than towards islam and today's tarish sister are number one media today is the television media the television satellite media today's statistics tell us there are more than 20000 television stations 20000 television stations reaching 5 billion people of the world more than 80% of the human beings are reached why are the television media this is the survey means if you take part in the television media the television media the satellite media is reaching 80% of the world population 5 billion people and the investment in this media is how much 400 billion dollars 400 billion dollars is the investment in this media and people are churning money out of it the majority more than 98% more than 99% is haram haram obscenity misinformation taking away from the truth more than 99% we have to utilize it and turn the tables over imagine 400 billion dollars invested only in the television media christians owning 50 channels 100 channels just making money out of it in america alone there are 1673 television stations out of which 83 are religious channel majority almost all they are christian channels majority throughout the world there are hundreds of christian channels hundreds there are hindu channels there are jain channels how many muslim channels do we have how many in india we have several hindu channels we have in india christian channels in regional language in english we have several channels we have in the regional south indian languages only for a part of india specialized targeting there are hundreds of christian channels number 1 is the god tv who has heard of the god tv oh mashallah more people know of god tv than many him god tv was launched about 10 years ago in 1995 by a britisher but it is uplinked from israel Do you know at present they are on 15 different satellites reaching more than 200 countries and having a viewership of 275 million people 275 million people is the reach 200 countries 15 satellites they have hired the god channel is one but there were separate god channel for asia separate for europe separate for america separate for india specialization like how the bbc there's bbc world is different bbc asia is different bbc europe is different why the 90% the matter is same but they want to even take advantage of the prime time prime time in uk is different than in uae it is different in bombay so according to the prime time they cater the program and they shift the timings so they hire different satellites So God channel is one of the most popular among the Christian missionary channels. But Christian channels there are hundreds of them. How many Islamic channels do we have? I know of many Muslim owning many entertainment channels. Many 5, 10, 20 many. I don't know name them. You may be knowing. They have groups of channels. How many Islamic channels do we have? How many channels we have for dawa? The first one that was launched was by Qadianis MTVA. Muslim TV Ahmadiyya. They are Muslims. Muslim TV Ahmadiyya, and it even comes in UAE in Dubai. 